The Virgo video is the sixth of the 12 sun sign videos for the 2024-2025 year. The zodiac or astrology year begins with the sign of Aries. In each video, Reverend Dr. Dickie Joe Mullen will discuss the potential for each month of the next zodiac year. Dr. Mullen begins each of the sun sign videos talking about the main characteristics of each sign. For Virgo, people would be described as caring, uh, grounded, considerate, fascinated with life and relationships with others, observant, healing, and a problem solver. Now we will listen to Dr. Mullen's discussion of the sun sign Virgo. Greetings, stargazers. I'm astrologer Dickie Jo Mullen here in Orlando, Florida, with a special forecast for the year to come for Virgo. This is for the spring, uh, March the 21st, which is International Astrology Day, the beginning of the Zodiac 2024, through the end of March of 2025. Virgo, you are fastidious, caring, and sensibly grounded. You are a mutable earth sign and ruled by the planet Mercury. You have a genuine gift for healing and problem solving, observant and always seeking to get everything organized. You have good intentions and forever seek perfection. You can be something of a worrier, but you have a wholesome dignity and are generally very considerate with your behavior and approach to people. This inspires the trust and admiration of co-workers and friends alike. At the spring equinox of 2024, there's an opposition involving your sun sign that hints at some competitive or turbulence elements within a relationship. Dedicate a seasonal rite of spring to compromise and harmony. Mercury will be retrograde from April 1st to the 25th, which is always difficult for this Mercury-ruled sign. This year it could bring an old mystery to be solved, and there could also be some reshuffling of finances, especially if you have any inherited or invested assets that you're working with. By May Day, Venus will be making a favorable aspect to your sun in Earth signs. This is a soft and benevolent influence. It creates harmony with any in-law connections as well as grandparent-grandchild interactions. Cultural events such as art shows, concerts, or theatrical productions can be enjoyable from early May through May 23rd, while this positive influence is in force. By the time June June begins, Jupiter is crossing your midheaven. This is an influential transit affecting your career sector. It will last to the end of the year. And opportunities to elevate your professional status can begin to become available in June. Aspire. Have faith in yourself. Try meeting a new professional challenge. You can definitely advance and grow over the summer. On June 9th, Mars changes signs and stress that was around you begins to lessen. A project is completed and there's time for a vacation. By the time summer solstice arrives, you'll feel closer to the land and nature. During July, your sector of long-term hopes and wishes is highlighted. You'll have plans involving a long-term goal that you will want to discuss with respected friends. You'll be aware of how influential associates can be operative in your life. There's a new moon on July 5th which highlights the specifics. By Lamas, Mercury enters your first house and this brings a curiosity which sharpens your ability to process information. Honor the early harvest of August into early September by sharing a poem or recipe at a seasonal gathering. From August the 5th to 28th, there's a favorable Venus influence. Both business and pleasure connections are promising. 
express a creative idea, make a beautiful presentation, whether it's for work or a social situation. The only new moon in your birth sign of Virgo this year will be on September 2nd of 2024. Try to write a wish list on September 2nd for what you would like um, during the year to come, and you can be pleasantly surprised between this birthday and your next birthday as to how much of it actually manifests. At the autumn equinox, the week of September 23rd, a stimulating Mars aspect brings more enthusiasm about daily routine. Meetings and conversations can involve a Halloween plan with details you'll share with others. At Halloween this year of 2024, plan a futuristic costume, perhaps inspired by a sci-fi story or the space program. That would be a good choice. If there's an alien sighting, use that as your theme for your Halloween costume. By the time November begins, your attention shifts toward a family member. A home repair project might be involved. Be a good listener, then you'll know what steps to take by November 15th to promote goodwill among relatives. Throughout the last half of November, an earthy Venus transit comes along, suggesting that you get involved in nature. Maybe some glam camping, not anything too rustic, but a or a comfortable outdoor stroll to take scenic photos appreciating nature. An outdoor stroll um, could also bring you into tune with an unusual animal encounter. I don't see anything dangerous about this, but it could be amusing and enjoyable. By December 1st, express gratitude in a meditation or ritual for everything you've experienced this year as you look ahead toward the winter solstice. An opportunity to help those in need is available. What about doing some charity work during this Yuletide season? This could involve adopting um, an animal, temporarily at least from a shelter, or assisting a vulnerable person. December 7th through 16th reveals the specifics of this. Surprise visitors interrupt your plans, but they provide congenial company uh, during the last part of December, especially from the 17th through New Year's Eve, December 31st. As 2025 opens, there's a Venus influence involving relationships, business or personal. A one-on-one -on -one relationship looks better as the new year begins. Appreciate the accomplishments of those close to you. A relationship with an especially intelligent or talented person can warm your heart during early January. Acknowledge a special achievement and by maybe dedicating a meditation candle to this by candle mass on February 1st and 2nd. From February 14th to March 1st of 2025, new viewpoints and changing offers can encourage a complete change of direction somehow in your life. Information is shared which reveals new options. A description of a situation is retold to reveal a different twist or story, especially after the full moon on March 5th. As winter ends, you will leave a situation which has grown stale. Open the doors and windows of your home or workplace. Let in a fresh spring breeze to blow away any cobwebs as March 20th, the end of winter, approaches. For your health, always a favorite Virgo subject, this year you'll sense a change in your health and vitality near the time of the total lunar eclipse on March 4th of 2025. And insights regarding your path to wellness will come late in the winter. For self-care, develop your potential as an artist. Blend some colors that express how you feel. Maybe design a simple mandala. Incorporating words and symbols to mark the important milestones or concerns in your life. As a learning experience, take time to appreciate everything that has touched your life, whether it has been for good 
or not. It's taken you this far. That's a good mandala or good affirmation for the winter. Two full moons in a row this year on June 21st and July 21st enhance love opportunities. They both affect your fifth house, and this is the fifth solar house of romance. Look for a unique opportunity in the summer um, to either enhance a new romance or nurture a long kindling, kindled relationship to rekindle it. Plan to enjoy moon gazing with a special someone at those times, and the moon becomes illuminating as far as what true love really means in your life over the summer. Looking at spirituality for you, there's a Uranus retrograde from September 1st of 2024 through January the 30th of 2025. This affects your philosophy of life and higher consciousness. Explore past incarnations and access the Akashic records. Deepen your spiritual awareness. This is also an excellent time to forgive and forget. Release a past trauma or bad memory or old anger and integrate the concept of forgiveness into your spiritual path. Finances this year are affected by two eclipses, one on March 25th and one on October 2nd. And this is a time to expect the unexpected. Have a bit of an emergency fund set aside. A different source of income could replace the status quo. A favorable Jupiter influence um, right around the 24th of May brings a promising financial potential your way. Examine options for enhancing your financial security throughout May of 2024. This has been a sun sign forecast. It's the tip of the iceberg. It uses just the sun's position. That's the familiar zodiac sign that everybody knows. So there can be some variables, but follow this to see how the path of the sun shows how you will shine in a general way during the year ahead. I'm Dickie Joe in Orlando, Florida, wishing you a bright and beautiful year to come. Thank you for watching this video. Contact information for Reverend Dr. Dickie Joe Mullen are as follows. Her email address has recently changed, templetoncat13 at gmail.com, Facebook, Sky Maiden Musings, her website, which offers daily meditations and other information regarding her work, and her YouTube channel address. Reverend Dr. Dickie Joe Mullen, astrologer, psychic, and parapsychologist. Dr. Mullen provides astrology, psychic, rune, and tarot card readings. She also conducts face-to-face -face and Zoom readings and seances, webinars, and face-to-face -face presentations.